First, though, the effort to strip Disney of its special district status and why it could dramatically increase your tax bill. A vote set for tomorrow would be a game changer for Disney and Central Florida. Glad you're with us tonight. I'm Matt Austin. And I'm Lisa Bell. The move comes just weeks after Disney spoke out against a new education law that critics call the Don't Say Gay Law and halted all giving to political campaigns. Today, the Senate voted 23 to 16 to end the Reedy Creek Improvement District and five other special districts across the state. The House will consider the bill starting at 10 a.m. tomorrow morning. If the bill becomes law, the districts would be dissolved on June 1st of 2023. Roy and Walt Disney insisted on the creation of the Reedy Creek Improvement District as a condition of building Disney World in Florida. Under the deal approved back in 1967, Disney essentially governs itself, pays for its own services, and can issue bonds to finance infrastructure projects. If and when the Reedy Creek Improvement District is dissolved, Orange and Osceola counties will be on the hook for nearly $1 billion in bond debt. The Orange County tax collector says it could lead to an increase in property taxes of 15 to 20 percent. I think the county gets hamstrung there. I, I don't think there's anything that they could do except raise property taxes on every single person in Orange County. So along with concerns about taxes, some people at Reedy Creek are worried they could lose their jobs. News 6's Troy Campbell is live in the newsroom with that part of the story. Well, for members of the Reedy Creek Fire Department, they are on constant high alert, ready to jump into action during an emergency anywhere on Disney property. So tonight I spoke with their union president about the recent push to dissolve the district to see what people on the inside are saying. As we sit here today, there's more unknown than known, obviously. This issue uh, popped up just a few days ago. A fire department located in Central Florida, whose firefighters come into contact with people from around the world each day and expect cell phones to be recording the second they arrive to an emergency inside Walt Disney World. Wayne Bernaska serves as the president of the Florida Professional Firefighters and says in recent days, Members of the Reedy Creek Fire Department have become concerned with the possibility they could be out of a job. They are as professional as they get as any other agency. You know, we they are not Disney employees. They are Reedy Creek employees. They are members of our Florida retirement system in, in their, in their um, uh, retirements. Following the developments day by day, Bernaska says he's been informed a final decision regarding the future of the Reedy Creek District would not be made until June 2023, adding members of the firefighters union still have about 14 months of uncertainty. Bernaska says he hopes state lawmakers also consider the families whom Reedy Creek firefighters take care of, saying any changes to the Reedy Creek District will also affect many others as well. Some of our fears have been calmed by knowing that there will be a process. We will be a part of that and we'll be able to um, verbalize and stand before the Florida legislature to voice our concerns. Bernaska also says the Florida Professional Firefighters Organization. Now, they prefer to stay out of the politics involved in the issue, adding their focus is on the job conditions for first responders. That said, he says there are plans to speak with lawmakers regarding their concerns in the very near future. Live in the newsroom tonight, Troy Campbell, Getting Results, News 6.